around the world. I'm killer. So welcome everybody to a brand new episode of the Mexican Express cooking with the best and crazy. Today we're gonna be here in the river looking for fish because today we're making fish tacos. I'm the best hunter. I don't need a fishing pole or anything. I'm just gonna go live, go in the water. So I hope you guys enjoy my recipe because we're gonna get started. So let's go in and let's look for that fish. Yeah. So what's up everybody, this is your favorite Santeezy Mexican Express crew with the best Santeezy. Right now I'm walking on the bridge of Rialto here in Italy, Venice. Hope you guys are gonna enjoy my next episode of Fish Tacos. So I can't wait to bring it to you. you guys are gonna love it. Everybody's looking at me because it looks like I'm talking crazy, but uh, it's okay. Let's go. Yeah. And welcome everybody to a brand new game show. Guess that obvious. I'm your host, Captain Edmundo. <laughs> and today we have two contestants. Let's bring them out. Remember, in this game, you have to be able to guess the object when the word passes up. Your partner needs to guess it. You have a time limit, so if you don't get it, you don't get the money, you don't win the prize. In this case, uh, <laughs> uh, a bottle of beer. <laughs> we'll figure something out later. This is a very low income game show. So uh, let's, let's begin our first contestant. Our first contestant, Sarno, who really loves butterflies. I'm just happy to be in the show. Our next contestant, Santeezy. Santeezy. Hey, hey, buddy. This is happy to be in the show. I'm ready. Let's go. I hope you guys are ready, so let's go ahead and start. And here's the first word. Sarno, take it away. Find this in the freezer. Um, rocks. Puppets. Batteries. Snowman. Uh, uh, Pluto. Uh, soda. Pass. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. Next word. <laughs> A person eating only fruits and vegetables. <laughs> Ugh, gross, disgusting. Peter Pan. <laughs> it has no animal products. <laughs> a zombie. A dragon. Robocop. <laughs> Puff! Ooh, I'm sorry, time is up, man. Damn it! Kind of man, I mean, why would Robocop be eating meat? <laughs> uh, Tired of working out and just not getting the results you need? Don't you wish you had something to give you a push? Well, now you can with Sam Teasy's steroids. Pump me up now! Just take a couple pills, no side effects included. Just make sure you don't stand in the sun and make sure you don't think happy thoughts. Thank you. Side effects include ass farts, bleeding of the ass, swelling of the ass, shrinking of testicles and penis. Random fighting, thoughts of suicide, thoughts of butterflies, speaking Russian, acting out Return of the Jedi, crying for no reason, seizures, and in most cases, death. We might have you. I think he has you now, boy. Church, do you give up? Sonny, you okay? Okay everybody, so this is what you're gonna need to make these fish tacos with a little side of pico de gallo. So here goes your fish, doesn't matter what type of fish you wanna use. In this case, I got some, uh, yeah, fish. Anyway, right here we got sour cream, we got some tortillas, you know, some that you could buy here. I mean, it's the best that Germany could offer. Here we got some fresh cheese, this is what we're gonna use to put on tacos. Some lemons, onions, some tomatoes, coriander, but we all know it's called cilantro. Some radishes, about two green onions, and right here some paprika, some chili, some black pepper that I picked up from Italy, mm -hmm. some salt, and some olive oil. So let's go ahead and start this up. Alright, check that out. A little too big, but... 
it nice and deep. Yeah, my boy. Hey, so you want to go ahead and squeeze about, about four of these. Right in there. Next, we want to go ahead and add some olive oil. There we go. Perfect. Now we're going to go ahead and dunk our fish in here, marinate. And we're going to leave it in here for about 10 to 15, 20 minutes. I would make more, but I think only me and our famous uh, David are going to join in dining today. So. Steve. Oh, oh shit. God, God. God. So now that we have our ingredients here, let's go ahead and make that pico de gallo. We're gonna actually save this for the tacos, but the onions, the green onions, actually the green onions are actually gonna go for the tacos, I'm sorry. Green tomato, onions, cilantro, go in that bowl with some lemons. Here we go. And there you had it, ladies and gentlemen. Fish tacos. Oh, let's go enjoy these bad boys right now. What do you think, David? I think they're awesome. <laughs> also, here in Germany, everybody, even kids everywhere, have bicycles. It's a healthy way. I can't tell you how many times I've seen grandmas on bicycles. Compared to America, where they're always on those little motor scooters that help them move. It's, it's kind of insane to see. Like I said, grandmas everywhere, grandmas there. Grandmas everywhere, grandmas where? It's all grandmas. So you know ladies that uh, 80, 90 years old can ride the bicycle. Ah, hello, servus. <laughs> What's up, guys? So today I'm actually in the German class. I wanted to show everybody here in Germany and my new professor that I can speak German. So I'm taking the class just to show them how good I am. So today I'm going to be showing you how to speak German. And I hope you guys like it. Oh, there goes my professor right now. Hey, how's it going, Hans Gruber? <laughs> hello. So, today. Speak German to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, ich bin Badisch Heiner und Santos. Haha, <laughs> Dijk. Ich komme aus dem in der Jahr oder nein. Und in Amerika. America, I mean, United States. <laughs> um, Santos, uh, that's not German. I, I don't know what language you're speaking, but that's just not German. Hello, this is Hans Gruber. Who is this? Hello, Hans Gruber. Hast du einen Studenten namen Santesi? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Well, ich bin oh. <laughs> Captain Hermoso. <laughs> er ist mein kleiner Bruder, der glaubt Deutsche zu können. Aber er ist wirklich kein Zurückgebleiben. Kannst du ihn bitte Spaß machen? Kein Problem. Danke, danke. Servus, tschüss. So, how's my German, Professor Hans Gruber? Well, Santisi, good job, little buddy. You're doing great. It's a perfect German. <laughs> of course, thanks man, thanks, I appreciate it. Hey, I'll come back next time, maybe I can speak to the class, wouldn't that be great? <laughs> yeah.
favorite pastime is football, but they like to call it American football. But here in Europe, of course, they like soccer, or what they call football. So let's see what the difference between football and American football really is. Yeah, here we go. Time to play some American football. Pick it up, pick it up! You are right, buddy? I'm good. Oh hell yeah, you're like a man. Oh you're oh damn! See, that's a man. That's football. Dude, are you okay? Are you okay? I, I, I didn't even touch you, man. Are you alright? Should I call the doctor? Oh. It's another Dude, are you alright? Are you alright? Okay, Let me just finish the play. Good. Are you okay, man? <laughs> hey everybody, welcome back to another Santisi message time. I think we just got a message. So our first message is going to be from Lisa. Let's see what she has to say. Hey Santisi, what's the hottest hot sauce that you have ever tried? Saludos desde España. The hottest hot sauce I've ever tried, huh? Well, I don't know what to tell you because I've eaten all types of hot sauces. I've eaten this. When it comes to this one, not too so hot, but this one's delicious. I've eaten that, I've eaten this, and even that. Yes, they all cause me tremendous types of pain in my ass, but hey, they're worth it. Once it goes in, it's delicious. But coming out, <laughs> it's a whole different other story. But anyway, yeah, so the strongest hot sauce I ever had. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try one more thing. It's gonna be this. Now this is truly made by the demons of hell. One drop is one Denny Schofield's of spiciness. If you ever look into the scale what a Schofield, Schofield is, I really recommend you guys check it out because one jalapeno, whew, that, that doesn't even come close. But look at that. One drop is recommended. I'm going to go ahead and try one drop now, see what you guys think. <sighs> Man, I don't know. I mean, this hot sauce is pretty hot. I mean, I'm in the Schofield's, uh, I mean, <laughs> that might kill me. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Think of it this way, man. If you don't do it, girls ain't gonna yeah, like you. It's gonna be super gay. You know what? <laughs> yeah, don't listen to him. I mean, okay. you're already married, plus, gay is love. He, he makes a lot of sense. <laughs> yeah, but if he doesn't he's do it, I'm making a he's point of real next to Follow your heart. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you should go with the hot sauce. So thank you everybody for joining us on my final season of the ending season finale, Fish Tacos. It's gonna be so delicious. Look at that. It came out so great. What do you think, Jay? I, I I think the not really what I intended, but yeah. Yeah, but you like it. Yeah, yeah, they were great, I suppose. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, guys. Also, to answer your question there, what's the hottest hot sauce I've ever tried? Like I said, we're about to try some of that one million Schofield hot sauce. A couple of drops on our top it should be enough. Are you down to join me in this adventure here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One million. <laughs> oh shit! Even comes like a <laughs> a drop. <laughs> but you know, we're not gonna use that. We're gonna put that to the side. You go ahead and put a couple drops. Here you go. Everybody, ready? Okay, it's not coming. It's not coming up. You know what that means. 
Oh shit, okay, that's a little bit of liquid fire. You're gonna have to get the same thing as I got. The little bit of liquid fire came out. And there you go. Now you're at the same thing. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and try it. Good night, world. Right there in the deck. Huh? Maybe find you some sour cream. Mm. Oh. Nope. Next button's a little. Yeah. Oh. Thank you for joining the Mitsu Express. Easy. Hope to see you guys. I'm proud of people that help me. Oh god. Hope to see you guys next season. We got a cut. Yeah. Sure. Cut. Cut. We got a cut. Dude, that's not normal. That is not normal. David! Hey, from TV. So, what do they eat for breakfast in Germany? And that's how you make an American pizza full of extra cheese, olives, and cheese. I'm making Chinese vegetables with beef. And then this is the sauce that I'm going to put in here. And then I'm going to make rice. Riding my bike in the snow, baby. Oh, yeah. Steak and steak. Oh, 